Hi guys! <laughs> I'm Ben, that's Randy, we're the Journal's Awakening. She just picked up the dying mouse. Just so you know, is that good? Is the camera good? The uh, camera's rolling. I know, it's just high usually. No, it's, it's good, it's good, okay. it's good. Anyway, God. she picked up a fuck. This big, guys. This face Let me was explain, this big. let me explain. Go ahead. I had to pee, so I walked into our bedroom in Mog. Her orange cat she is, sitting in there, bedroom. is sitting there. I'm like, oh, he's playing with a toy. But it wasn't a toy. And he was like, ah. and it was a mouse. And the mouse was laying there and he couldn't move his legs We have anymore. a bunch of toy mice around the house, just so you guys Like, know. they look the exact same. Yeah. And he couldn't move his legs and he had a little blood on the side of his neck. <laughs> so she I, comes out. I don't know. Get away. So I picked him up and I said, babe, what do I do with this mouse? <laughs> and he said, we have five cats and why Get it out of the house. What are you holding it so for? So I went and I put said. him on the trampoline with our outdoor cat. I said, why did you take the dead mouse from the cat? He wasn't dead yet. <laughs> I love all things. Probably terrible. But I believe in, you know, the circle of life, right? <laughs> the circle. I know. In hindsight, I should have just let him. Five cats. I probably so made she him suffer it. more. So Iggy, our 18-year-old outdoor kitty, she got a feast. And she loves mice. Oh, I man. panicked. I didn't know what to do, but I figured that the outdoor cat that never gets like to catch him, or maybe she does. Oh, she does. Maybe. Oh, she lives under the house. Yeah. <laughs> our outdoor cat stays under our trailer, and we don't know why. It's the mice. Yeah. She's eating them. Okay. Good but girl. we've never seen one until now. It's the first but time. First time ever. Now. At our Five old, cats. At our old house, we had a mice infestation. Yeah. They were catching like three a night in the house. Yeah. They were and in I my know it one sounds night. gross. But we live out in the country. Yeah. Having mice is very That's why we typical. have so many cats. <laughs> I know. And he's like, that's why we have cats. He should have let the cat finally eat the mouse. And instead, now they're searching for the mouse that I took outside. So I fed the cats. I was like, you get an extra meal today because mom took your kill. <laughs> and gave it to the old cat. <laughs> That's all right. Iggy deserved it. She's old. Yeah, she should have, right? I was like... Yeah, she's been eating mice her Well, because I, my initial thought was I got to let it outside, and I'm like, it's paralyzed. I wonder if I wonder if Iggy's going to bring it to us as a present, even though Does it was a present that? to her. Yeah, she always gives me the gift of so a she head. Sitting. <laughs> of a head. Yeah, I get the gift of a mouse head all the time. Oh, my God, babe. I should have just let Mo eat it. Okay, but here's the thing. At our old house, we had mice. Once I woke up at 2 in the morning, and her squeeze, 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 squeeze crunch, crunch, <laughs> crunch, yeah. and it was like a lion eating a baby. It was Mog eating a mouse, like, and boy, he caught it, he crunched Mog? into it, it was dumb. Our orange tabby, Mog, the, the, the dominant male around here, man, he's a, he's a monster. <laughs> A mouse goes into we a house We just got through five saying cats. that, yeah, dumb ways to die. Go into a house with five cats. <laughs> yeah. I did rinse my hands off. She with, rinsed with, her hands with soap for four seconds or so. That's the roll, right? Oh. Ew. Anyway. You didn't hear me scream, babe? Yeah, once. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, she's fine. I said, babe! <laughs> in our house <laughs> five cats <laughs> if i were me i would have said well i'm washing that blanket and let him eat it you know <coughs> you're like a real mouse <laughs> yes baby. i know i'm like prove it what <laughs> how <laughs> why, why are you holding it <laughs> <laughs> that was my first question why are you holding that <laughs> ew <laughs> Yeah, growing up, I I raised mice and, <laughs> me, and stuff. I, I knew this mouse was. <coughs> you could tell Mog hit him right in the spot, to, and his yeah, legs didn't work shot. anymore. <laughs> yeah, and it was just really depressing. But I brought him outside, and I was like, I can't just let him die in the cold. <laughs> He's gonna let him suffer. <laughs> I'll give him the Iggy. <laughs> she did quick work, huh? She did. She went. She looked at it for a second, and then it moved, and she went. And now she's gone for the trampoline. So yeah, she's gone. <laughs> I'm sure she took it somewhere. To her little feasting. She's probably got a little pile of mice bodies just somewhere. Right. Little mice skeletons, right? A little pile of them down there. <laughs> That's why she's so young again. <laughs> yeah, she's like, oh, you good. <laughs> Shoot. You guys know we got an infestation? <laughs> <laughs> it's the first one we've seen, but the cat's like like Bravo. He's always in that corner of the kitchen by the water. Always. Yeah. And I just figured it was like a... 
a bug, right? Like or a lizard. Okay, well, like a lizard got in the house, you know? I would so much rather now this is gonna sound gross to people, but I would so much rather have like a mice infestation than really anything else. That's true. Spiders are scary. Spiders are scary. Any other Snakes animal scary. that's out in the yeah. desert is scary. You know, I'll, I'll take mice. Yeah, I'll, I'll take the mice. <laughs> they're, they're harmless. You know what I mean? They're good for the cats. Yeah, they're harmless. Well, yeah, they're good exercise. Yeah, they're good for the cats. Mog's so. walking around like this right now. So people that think, you know, people <laughs> that are listening to this and they're like, they're okay with mice. <laughs> we live in the country and we have yeah. five cats. Really, that's no big deal. I leave it's the just, screen open. It was so unexpected. Yeah. I wasn't expecting to walk in and find my cat destroying a mouse. <laughs> We're washing those blankets. And he so. eats them. He eats them and they swallows them. them. Yeah, Iggy eats them too. Yeah. Except for the head. We're, Mog's never been an outdoor cat. I don't <laughs> Mog has some mean instincts in him. Dumb ways to die. Yeah, go after Mog. There you go. <laughs> Run away from Mog as a mouse. But this literally <laughs> just happened. Can you imagine if you got turned into a mouse? In our house? Yeah. Um, <laughs> the, the beast that you love. <laughs> <laughs> no, I hear that cats will eat you if you die in your house. Humans? Yeah, and I thought well, that Mog definitely would eat Mog me. Mog would, yeah. Mog's one of those, if he sees your finger sitting there for too long, he'll nibble on it. <laughs> He's like... <laughs> yeah, he likes to bite my nose when I don't <laughs> Wake up. <laughs> yeah. So what would you guys have done? <laughs> would you have thrown the mouse in the trash half alive? Would you have let the cat finish him off? Use the hammer? Or just thought... How would you have done it? Or would you have like... Yeah, people use hammers? I just had a flashback from my childhood. My dad and oh, puppies. Yeah. yeah. I don't Kittens. understand that. Anyway. But... Uh, <clears throat> yeah, what would you do? I say... Let the cats do their thing. No, you're like, right. good job, pat on the head. You I know? should have walked away, but I saw that it was still alive, and I just <laughs> my motherly instincts. Mom looked at in. you like, "Mom, look away." <laughs> yeah. I'm doing what every man has to do. <laughs> I touched you, went away. I told him, "I'm sorry." <laughs> no, don't don't talk to your food. It makes it's it not personal. My food. Imagine if you had a cow named Betsy and you're like, tonight, hamburger helper, Betsy. Me and you. <laughs> you yeah, know? that's exactly what it is. That's sad. Isn't it weird that when we're eating it, we just can't compute these things? Yeah, and I was a cattle rancher for years. So we should go to a slaughterhouse. I loved my cows. We should force ourselves to watch the whole no. process. Why? Because then what? I lose my man handles and then what? I'm just like MGK body? I don't want that. <laughs> They're called love handles. They're man handles. <laughs> That's how you manhandle a man. You grab him by his man handles. <laughs> You're like, hold still. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> the first mouse in this house in two the years. The first mouse in this house didn't last too long, but I think he's been here a while, and I think there's more. And I think that's why Iggy goes under the house. It, I think it's a good possibility for sure. There's that one hole in the kitchen bottom cabinet wall where that's probably definitely where they're coming in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so we know what we got to fix. But at the same time, five cats. <laughs> Imagine we're like, all right, landlord, we'll move down the street until you're done with this. And then he gets in here. And it's, it's like a mouse in the station. Dude, imagine if all the cats weren't here. Yeah. If Iggy wasn't outside every day, and if the other four weren't inside all day, there would be a mouse nest. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely. I'm definitely still debating him. I'm definitely going to sprinkle that's, sugar before we leave. That's another podcast for sure, but I'm definitely on the I'm coming back when it's done kind of boat. Like I'm, I don't think I'm going anywhere. I know. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, I'm just that's too much of, stress. I'm Ooh. just like, oh. I watched this this comedian last night. He's fucking funny. He's talking about, remember in the 90s when all men wore cargo pants? Now everybody's in skinny jeans, right? Mm -hmm. You see plumber come over to skinny jeans. You don't expect any work to get done. He's going to come over and look at the drain and go, Ewie, yeah, that's gross. But uh, a man in cargo pants comes over. Anyway, get to the bottom of that joke. He says it was cool being... Uh, young man and having cargo pants in the 90s because if you had to move apartments you just loaded your pants you just walked it over to the next apartment unit you're not laughing or smiling and it's freaking me out <laughs> i'm, I'm not nervous. into comedy i'm just thinking He's a guy so in skinny weird. jeans can definitely do the job just as well no he can't Look, skinny jeans go bend over and 
And skinny jeans? Oh no, that gives a whole new meaning to plumber's crack. Like, imagine, his cheeks are compressed. <laughs> That's fair. They're compressed, which means all that sweat in there is just tight. It's airtight. You know what I mean? It's not good. It's not a good look. I'm traumatized. You should be. By the situation. I should have just saw what was happening and walked away. <laughs> I can't turn are we talking a blind about skinny eye. jeans or are we talking about the mouse? The mouse. Oh. Poor Mog is wondering where his kill went. That's and why I, I fed it him. to his elder. <laughs> <clears throat> Here you go, Elder. You need it. She knows what to do with it. She's Eat outside. We could have put Mog out. Yeah, I would have felt more comfortable yeah. if he ate it outside. Yeah, exactly. But you can count on Iggy leaving us a present on the front porch. We'll see. So We yeah. haven't been talking very long, so. Uh, yeah, we have. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Did I write? <laughs> yes! Got you! <laughs> Anyway, on that note, we thank you. <laughs> we thank you. Wow. <laughs>